Hi Libra, welcome to your love reading. This is Feline Intuition Tarot. This is going to be for Libra, Sun, Moon, Venus, and Rising. Let's see what messages want to come out for you. What are the messages for Libra? What do we have for Libra for December? Reconciliation. And I just glimpsed the unfinished business card and we got text message. Someone's going to reach out to you this month, December. What else for Libra? Fated meeting and roll the dice. So either you met this person by fate or you may meet another person. Let's see. What are the messages for Libra? The main event, reaching the climax in your story. Happy ending, the best part. So something's about to happen. Spiritual gifts. Messages for Libra. Divine energy. And past events affecting current energy. So whoever is coming towards you this month, you guys have a history with them. What's the energy between Libra and the person they're thinking about for December? What's the energy gonna be to, gonna be between these two? Libra and their person. Ooh, their energy towards you. This person feels a deep connection, but you are, <laughs> you're pushing them away. So you are pushing them away, looking elsewhere. You may have turned your back on this situation, but I see them reaching out. They seem to have a master plan about how to make this work. It could be a, a Aries, a Scorpio. There is some transformation happening between you and this person on your mind. They seem very possessive of you, the Emperor in reverse. For some of you, they have unrealistic expectations about the connection, but they feel like it's destined. You might find this confusing. I mean, I find it confusing. I don't know what kind of epiphany this person had with the Wheel of Fortune, but it's like you're not on the same page as them at the moment. You could be questioning why they're coming forward. Some of you, there's also a new person coming in as well. Let me look at the main spread. Other messages for Libra for December. Other love messages. <clears throat> love messages for Libra. The High Priestess again. Something about this connection is spiritual. You might open up to them a bit. You're seeing them as the Emperor in reverse. They have the Empress. Knight of Wands. Three of Wands in reverse. Knight of Cups. This person might come towards you, but it may cause you a lot of confusion as to why they're coming forward. Some of you could be at work or school. They could want to collaborate with you on something. Why do they have the Knight of Wands here as feelings? They're very passionate about you. It's still not telling me what happened. Why the Empress?
they had some kind of disappointment that made them kind of get up i guess maybe something caused them to work on themselves some kind of disappointment why the four of cups in reverse you got the four of cups here so you're gonna go from like when with the knight of cups when they come forward you're gonna go from not really paying them any mind or not really wanting to accept their offer and really focusing on yourself to hearing them out for some of you you might hear them out why the emperor in reverse Could be a Pisces for some of you, but Aries and Capricorn. But this person, I don't know, you're seeing them as controlling, possessive, that they hide things. Why the fool in reverse? They know that you found out about them or found something out. I feel like something in this needs to be revealed why did the three of pentacles come out there's something you see with roll the dice it's like this person in the past they were one way and you literally rolling the dice by giving them a chance because it's like are they have they really changed or how or is this an act we do have divine energy spiritual gifts so it's a possibility that they worked on themselves but the question is like because of how you're seeing them it's questionable why the ten of cups in reverse some of you might reject this person yeah some of you you may have worked on yourself you could be in a connection to where this person just makes you feel like i don't know if you just see them as the way they were in the past but i see you freeing yourself from all toxicity i see you like testing the waters with them but with the outcome being the ten of cups in reverse because of the four of wands it's like you've you've kind of made a life for yourself where you found stability without this person i am being drawn to past energies affect current past events affecting current energy so there's something they did in the past that you can't get past what are the messages for libra Divine energy, sorry, divine feminine, feminine energy, commitment, marriage, proposal, fidelity, obscurity, secrets, mysteries, concealing, confessions, unveiling, coming clean messages. So something, they're going to come clean about something, some kind of secret. There's something behind the scenes though that I feel like you're cautious about. What are the messages for Libra? Twin flames, two bodies, one soul. Okay. Revenge, settling the score. Temptation, coven, soul tribe. Confusion, inner turmoil. Secret admire. Ouch. Secret admirer, shyness. Emotional repression. I feel like you're questioning this person a lot. You definitely probably won't trust them. But I see you meeting someone by fate. So you might choose someone else over someone from the past who did something to you. Or that they may want to get some type of revenge. If you are like suspicious of them, you're probably right because it's not looking good. What are the messages for Libra for December? Who are you? Sorry, you are who you are. Be proud of it. If true love requires compromise. Cherish the broken child inside you first. Stable and healthy 
how the connections grow slowly. So I feel like you're being cautious because you do have this stability energy with the four of wands. I do see you healing yourself. So I feel like you don't want to take a risk with someone. So whoever you have history with, there's a lot of caution needed. Other messages for Libra. That young female family, past life, fair male. Some of you could still be young, just starting your life. You could be getting ready to start a family or soon to meet someone who you could start a family with. I just feel like. It's either this person like reveals the truth to you and they're being real or they're being shady. So I would say slowly. If you see this person rushing, that will be a sign that it's that it's not the right thing because with that stable and healthy connections grow slowly and there is something kind of possessive about this person from the past. So that will be a sign to know if they're up to something or not so this is what i'm seeing there could be a capricorn sagittarius pisces taurus virgo libra like yourself capricorn again yeah those are the main signs so i hope this was helpful thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you in the next one